O'Neill outside today. Oh man, what a trout. Oh my goodness, what a trout. Got him. Oh man, what a trout. Good grief. What a trout. I want to show you this fish. Now he's a toothy guy too. All right, I got my hands on him now. All right, feel, feel him, Jesse. Oh. See how big he is? Oh yeah. Uh, that fish is going to be about 17 inches long. Let's let him live. Sure. Okay. And great. Awesome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> First catch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, probably another bluefish. That's what took him so long to get it. Let me yeah. see him raise him up here. Same thing. That same, same thing. Same yeah. thing as a blue. The bluefish. He's a real toothy guy, and he's very aggressive. Okay, there's fish are out there. So let's let you hold on again. Get your. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now this, I'll, I'll let you feel this guy right here. This is a ladyfish, uh -huh. Jesse, and there he goes. And that's not bad that he's gone because they do do all over everything. <laughs> <laughs> How big was that? Uh, that fish was about two feet long. He's real thin, real skinny and long. Uh -huh. And they're fun to catch. It's unusual that uh, he's got a real hard mouth. Mm -hmm. It's unusual for you to get the hook into him really enough so that he can get caught or she can get caught as the case might be. Hmm. <laughs> so the biggest the biggest catch out here would be a red then. Yes. Okay. You know, that what I will tell okay. you though that trout you caught? Yes. That was a, that was spectacular trout in these thin waters. Wow. That felt like a pretty good fish. Yep. Yeah. All right, hold on. Let's see here. What Another trout. another trout, a big one too. My goodness! Oh boy, let me get let me get him subdued. Okay, you got another here. Let's see. Let me show you the size. One, all the way come all the way back. And you can see how big he is. Whoa! Yeah, yeah he's a good size. Yeah. <laughs> you bet he is. Yeah. There it is, yeah, that's a, that would be a keeper speckled trout. Hmm. Jesse, what are your plans for the Independence Fund for Southern California? Well, um, what we want to be able to do, O'Neill, is to mimic what we've done here in the East Coast, here in Buford, and take it to the West Coast and hopefully be successful with that. Um, we're trying to acquire 121 acres of property at the baseline of Yosemite, uh, and that location has a river, a lake, uh, trails and all that stuff. So um, hopefully we'll be successful acquiring that property and um, we'll have the same thing, if not even more activities there in the West Coast. You're gonna get it done, aren't you? It's not if. Nothing has <laughs> stopped me from doing what I want. It will get done. So the process is in, in motion as we speak. So uh, it's just a matter of time. I'd say probably about a, about 110. There he is. Hey boy. I think you just need to lift this one. 